Okay. So let's go over and just take a look at uh, the form render skip logic um, external module. So this is something that you would request, uh, the form render skip logic. And I've created a, well, I have a, a project that looks a little um, complicated, but it is not. Um, there's these different uh, instruments, but the ones that we mostly care about are these four at the end. Okay, uh, there's a male-only form and a female-only form and a big critters form and a small critters form. All right, so the concept of form render skip logic is only show a form in a longitudinal study, only show the form if a certain response has occurred on another instrument. So in this case, if I look at my animal identification instrument, there are two fields that are going to drive what I show you. One is weight and the other is sex. So I only want to show, I'm going to go back to my designer here, I only want to show a female only form if I've selected female on the animal identification instrument. Obviously the same with male. And based on the weight, I'll show the big critters uh, if, if the weight is a certain criteria, it meets a certain criteria, and small if it doesn't. So I want what I need to do is take my external module and configure it um, so that it can drive all of this ability to skip all these unnecessary instruments um, based on the selection in the original field. So the original instrument. So I'm going to start with if, you know, I have all my fields here, if the gender in that first arm, which is where we're setting the first arm in the first event, which is where we're setting the gender, um, the branching logic is if it equals one, which is male, then show only the male form. And then I added another branching logic to say if it equals two, which is female, then show only the female form. So that branching logic was surrounding this control field. The second control field is the weight. And again, I'm looking on that initial event it's a longitudinal study, and I could pick different events to drive these things. Branch, I mean, you know, show or hide uh, forms based on what I, show, I select, and I'll demonstrate this for you. So for the branching logic for the weight, if it's less than equal 20 grams, then it's a small critter. If it's greater than 20, then it's a big critter, and I only want to see those instruments. Okay, so I'm just going to save that, and let's take a look at how it works. I'm going to add a new record here. I'm going to go to my, and, and notice that I have no, uh, nothing showing here at the moment. Um, so I'm just going to collect something today. I'll say it's a marlin, and we'll say it's 500 grams and it's a male. I'll say it's complete, save and exit, and now notice that I only am showing the male only form and the big critter form based on what I selected in animal identification. These forms are irrelevant. Come in here, add another record. Oops.
and we'll say jellyfish vertebrate whatever and we'll say this weighs 10 grams and this is a female notice I've got female only and small critters so it allows you to skip any instruments that are irrelevant to selections you made previous. It ensures that you're only using the forms that are relevant and you don't start entering data into instruments that don't correspond to some selection that you made on a previous one. I'll go back and show again uh, on the external module, the configuration, so it might make more sense. Again, I took the, the gender, um, actually here, I should have put something in here, I think. Uh, if the animal sex was male, it shows only the male. And see, this is the branching logic that is applying to the downstream uh, instruments. Any questions? Uh, does this work? Uh, does it matter if the record is set to complete? Uh, no. Uh, it doesn't matter, and we'll demonstrate that real quick, just to be safe. Uh, add a record, and butterfly. Okay, so I did I did not um, set it to complete, yet it still knew that it's a small critter and female only. Does it work on surveys? Well, let's take a look. Uh, let's go to project setup, enable the survey, go to our designer, enable this as a survey. my survey distribution tools okay so I'm going to collect this today snake uh, let's say this is a big snake we'll say it's 35 grams and it's male I'll submit close the survey look at the record status dashboard for follow-up and we have for this particular record that we just entered, male only and big critters. So yes, it works on surveys, Tanya. So uh, that's the form render skip logic. If you um, are looking to ensure that you get accurate data collection uh, on uh, your projects.